The Arizona Cardinals defense is a challenge for any offense. And the reason they're a challenge for any offense is because they're one of the higher percentage blitz teams in the NFL. They really put a burden and a challenge on an offensive line, and the Eagles will have to meet that challenge this week. And what they do with a lot of their front looks is they run games or stunts off of them. Here you're going to see one that's an inside stunt between Corey Peters and Frosty Rucker. This is really beautifully done, and it pressures Matthew Stafford. Now Stafford escapes here, and the nice thing is we know Carson Wentz can do that as well, but this is not the way you want to make your living on offense, having to make random improvisational plays against a fast defense that's very good with their pressure concepts. The one player on their defensive front who's really tough to handle is Chandler Jones. Now, not only can Chandler Jones beat the best left tackles in the league, but they also use Chandler Jones in fronts where he also is part of stunts. This particular one is what we call an ET stunt because Jones from the end position, the E part, he goes first and you can see him just blow up the guard. This is really well executed. Again, pressure on Matthew Stafford. He's able to get rid of the ball for a completion, but the defense wins here. This is what the Cardinals do exceptionally well. And again, the Cardinals do such a good job with their front alignments to create these opportunities. So the Cardinals, under James Betcher, their defensive coordinator, they're a blitzing team. They're a multiple front team. They run a lot of stunts. The point is, there's a lot with what they do up front. And they do have Patrick Peterson to cover. So this is a team that presents a real challenge for the Eagles offense. Hey, the Eagles have now become a running team. In fact, they've got the most runs in the NFL of 10 or more yards. It's been impressive the last couple weeks, and they've done it a lot against teams when they have an extra safety or cornerback on the field. They take a linebacker off. Mm -hmm. Not so much the case against the Cardinals, right? Well, John, against the sub packages that is what they're called, the Eagles will run the football a lot because you're expecting pass. When you look at the Cardinals, they're very stingy in the sub packages. And one of the reasons why, when they bring extra guys on the field to defend against the run, all these guys are interchangeable parts for the Cardinals. All of these guys, they not only play the linebacker spot or the safety spots, but they can blitz. They're all very good tacklers, and that's why they're one of the best teams in the National Football League in stopping the run in their sub packages. So what's important for the Eagles is to continue to do what they're doing. They're outstanding in these double teams. Watch how well these guys work in combination with one another, controlling the line of scrimmage, getting off to the second level. Watch this Jason Peters move. This is just unbelievable for a guy who's been around so long the double team getting off to the second level and just creating space, creating a new line of scrimmage for the offensive line and running backs coming behind them. It's going to be key, very important in the run game versus the Cardinals. Yeah, they're giving up less than two yards when they're in their sub packages. That's very impressive for the Cardinals. Very impressive. That's a good defense. And James Betcher, their defensive coordinator, he likes to blitz a lot, but they've been able to get it done up front with just their front four.